So Nordstrom has dropped Ivanka Trump's brand from its stores, huh? This is reported by the New York Times. They're saying that her stilettos will soon be harder to find at Nordstrom's. The department store chain said on Thursday that it had decided to put the brakes on its relationship with Ms. Trump and removed her brand from a list on its site. We've said all along we make buying decisions based on performance. In this case, based on the brand's performance, we've decided not to buy it for this season. What's up, everybody? This is R. Boogie, the host of Fair Play, and I am here just to tell you a little something, something about what's going on and um, how Donald J. Trump's actions are affecting his entire family and have been for a little while now. Um, apparently, there's this boycott campaign going on called Grab Your Wallet, and you know what that's supposed to be mocking. Grab your, you know what. Anyway, that was coined by Trump last year. <laughs> But anyway, Grab Your Wallet campaign um, has encouraged people to boycott any Trump products being sold anywhere. And Ivanka Trump sells a line of shoes with Nordstrom. She sells some clothes and whatnot as well, but her shoes are her main product. And so for the past four years, they've been on Nordstrom's shelf. Well, as of lately, Nordstrom has made a decision to stop selling her products because of this boycott. Sales have gone down, of course. People have stopped buying their stuff. And we already know that Macy's dropped the line of clothes from um, Donald, Sh John I'm sorry, Donald Trump back in 2015. And she had a jewelry line that sales went down back in 2015 somewhere in California as well. And so now it's her shoes and clothes at Nordstrom. And she was one of the top selling brands in the store well because of this boycott and because sales have gone down uh nordstrom say nope we can't do it anymore now just this past november they were actually defending having her products in their store because people were mad about it and they were getting a lot of flack saying you know why would you carry her stuff her father's a racist he's this he's that you know all the negative things people have been saying about trump but they defended it and they said that you know just because we decided to sell her stuff in our store, that doesn't mean that we're taking a political stance at all. They just wanted to sell their stuff, her stuff to make money, of course. Well, of course, naturally, because it's not making money, they've dropped it. So, you know, I kind of feel bad for Ivanka in a sort of kind of way, but not really, <laughs> but sort of kind of. Because it's a shame that the actions of her father is affecting the entire family. They better get together and talk to their daddy, <laughs> really, because there's no telling how far the negativity can go and how much it can affect them financially and socially. I know they're rich and everything, but, uh, you know, the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Um, all right, if anybody wants to comment on this particular news story, I have put the link to the actual story. You can read all about it for yourself in the comments. Well, I'm sorry, down in the description. Uh, put your comments below. Um, yeah, and check me out every Wednesday at 7 p.m. Central on the Tracy Larkin Broadcast Network. Um, once again, my name is R. Boogie, and I am the host of the show. Y'all take care, and I'll talk to you later. Goodbye.